I'm authentic. Who are you? I'm authentic. Who are you? I'm authentic, real name, no gimmicks. What up, people? It's Authentic Benny, and I'm back with another video, man. Back with another video. Uh, today, we got jazz. Y'all can hear panting and breathing all hard. That's because she is about to be in labor this weekend, man. She's definitely showing signs, man, as y'all can see right here. Come here, Jazzy. Come here, Jazzy. Look, she could barely jump up, man. Barely, barely jump up. But uh, she's doing good, but y'all here panting and breathing all hard. That's because it will not be long, man. We got a cesarean set up for Saturday morning, but I'm thinking she not gonna make it. I'm thinking she not gonna make it to the appointment. I think we all had to take her in early, do an emergency uh, C-section, but we'll see. But that's the reason why we making this video, you know, because uh, a lot of people only see what they want to see and they don't see the full side or even show the full side of this whole breeding thing, you know. Uh, it ain't always pretty. It ain't always good. It ain't always um, glitz and glamours and puppets, you know. And today, I'm going to show y'all exactly how to know when your dog is about to give birth or close to give birth and when you need to plan to have your cesarean because it can be hard to pinpoint the date when your dog actually took like when you do an ai you gotta you gotta realize it still take time for the sperm to travel up you know and y'all know this work it's, it's not a it's not a biology class but it takes time you know you just can't do the ai six three days i'm gonna have puppies no it takes way more than that uh, so there's a few things you can do. Uh, one is what I'm gonna do today is temperature. Y'all see the little dog on the end, man? You know, uh, got a little thermometer. Uh, the average, the average dog temperature is around 101, something like that. And when we got a pregnant dog, it's about to have some puppies. It usually drop down to about 98. When it drop down to 98, chances are 24 hours after that, you will indeed have puppies. But the issue with that is, French Bulldogs require a cesarean, right? So you can risk losing your, your dog and the whole litter if you don't time this right. So you gotta make sure you time this right. Uh, I will be doing this off camera because of obvious reasons. I'm not that type of dude to put all everything on camera, but uh, I let y'all know what I'm doing. Pretty much, there's only one way to check the temperature on a dog. Like I said, it's not always glitz and glamours. It's a, it's not always uh, uh, nice puppies hopping around. Sometimes you just gotta get down and dirty. This don't go under the tongue. Like you do, you know what I'm saying, a little kid or whatever. You gotta go to the back end. Gotta go to the back end. That's why I got my clear protective cover over it. I'm gonna little rubber on it. Like I said, I'm gonna get this done off camera and I'll come back and let y'all know how it went. But uh, I wanna let y'all know that there's a couple other ways to try it too. You can uh, do a reverse progesterone test. Um, usually when it's below two or something like that, she she can have she good for cesarean she can have the puppies. Uh, you don't want to take the puppies too early because that can cause all types of health problems or you can lose your whole litter. You know so you want to make sure you're on point with that man. But she's showing major major signs. If she wasn't showing signs, I'll take her to get a reverse progesterone. But she's showing major major signs of having the puppies real real soon. So uh, what I'll do is I'll just take a temp. Tonight, 
and then take her temp tomorrow morning and we'll just go from there. So let's get it. All right, y'all, so we back, we back. Uh, that took all of maybe five minutes to do. We got that done. Uh, it, it looked like she good, man. We got like 99.6, 99.7. I actually did it twice. Uh, we got two of them in. She not below the 98 Fahrenheit point yet. So it is a go, man. She good to go. I will test her again in the morning time. And I will test her again tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening. So I will be keeping y'all posted on that. Like I said, I do have cesarean set up for Saturday morning. Today is Wednesday. So Thursday, I'll check her three times a day. Friday, I do the same thing. Get up early in the morning, test her three times a day. Saturday, of course, we got a schedule to go in already. And uh, I get the vet to do a reverse progesterone and make sure she good, you know, but I won't take her in until she drop below that 98 uh, level. So, uh, of course, I keep y'all posted. Of course, y'all gotta stay tuned. Man, I'ma uh, I'm walk y'all out there real quick. So we can check out Nala and Authentic Stormy because I, I, it's been a minute since I put them on the vlog. So we about to head out there right now to see what they talking about, man. Let's go. All right, y'all, we out here. Look, we got them running up. Stormy right there, Jazz right there, Nala right there. Yeah, they running up on me, man. Jazz still trying to run. Ooh, look at Jazz. Jazz, Jazz, don't get him, Jazz. Don't get him, Jazz. Look at Jazz. Jazz plays zero games. Stormy. 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 Look at Nala. Nala gonna be a fool too now. Bruh, Jazz usually hop up on that gate, like all the way up trying to get that dog. Look at her. Zero games, bruh. She usually hop way up there, but like I said, she big and pregnant. She trying to chill out now. And uh, of course, we got Stormy. Stormy's up next. She gonna be around mid-year, so y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for the Merle puppies. She gonna be pressure, man. She built like a man, man. Look at her. She built like a boy. <laughs> so, uh, the one who I'm actually teaming her up with, it's gonna be some pressure, man. So, y'all gotta make sure y'all stay tuned for that. And of course, little Nala. Oh yeah, Nala. Oh yeah, Nala. Come here, Nala. Ah, ah. Get back, Stormy. Come in now. Nala trying to bite me, man. What's wrong with you, Nala? Come on, Nala. Looks scary. Nala. Come in. So we got authentic Nala right here. You know, always excited, always happy, always playing. Uh, she probably would be mid or uh, late next year. You know what I'm saying? 2023. The end of 2023, she got a long way to go. She just a little puppy, you know, but I already got her stud locked in ready, you know, so um, I know a lot of people love the creams, man. Look, she want to get down now. Come on, go ahead. No. But a lot of people love the creams. Uh, some people only want creams, man. They got so many Facebook groups that's just for cream french bulldog so so it's definitely gonna be up man we definitely got a lot a lot of plans for authentic frenchies y'all make sure y'all hit that sub button y'all make sure y'all stick around for this content it's gonna be crazy man jazz i really thought she was gonna be uh i really thought she was gonna show a lower temperature than what she is because she's showing major major signs like the shivering the uh creating a nest the, all kind of stuff, all kind of signs she's showing. So I definitely figured she'd be uh, drop that temperature. And I thought I was gonna have to make arrangement for uh, an emergency cesarean, but turns out her temperature is still good. But by tomorrow evening, I'm gonna test it again, test it again. If I see it dropping the slightest bit, I will schedule her for emergency cesarean. So uh, y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for that. Um, that's a girl. Oh, another thing, she is not eating. Started this morning. Like, I put the food out, she just left it there. And Jazz, a beast, she usually down her food in one sitting. She's not eating, which is a major, major sign, man. She just left her food alone, barely drinking water. You know, there's just other signs to look for. Look at Stormy, man. She ain't gonna do nobody nothing. 
But uh, man, y'all definitely stay tuned. We got some big things coming. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you follow Authentic Dot Frenchies to stay up to date with everything, man. I appreciate the people who locked in already. Um, again, follow Authentic Dot Frenchies on Instagram to stay up to date. I uh, appreciate y'all rocking with us again, man. I hope you found this video informative. Please hit the DM on uh, Instagram if you have any questions, any uh, any video ideas, something you want to know about breeding, and I will get back to you, man. Just let me know. Once again, my name is Authentic Benny, and I'm out.